Mimo, could you take me to Radio Shack? Sure, maybe later. Later's a little vague. Could you please be more specific? When I'm getting ready? How's that? Better, but I'd really like to nail this down. No. Why don't you ask your father to take you? Dad? What? Can you please take me to Radio Shack? I'm busy. Ask your Mima. I did. She said to ask you. Well, ask her again. Seems counterintuitive, but all right. Mima. Oh, Lord. Everything okay? No. Stephanie Hansen's daughter was in a car accident last night. She died. Oh, no. My God. She was barely 16. That's horrible. Is there anything we can do? I don't know. Um, oh, I need to call folks at the church. <sighs> Any more thoughts on Radio Shack? Sheldon, do you really think this is the appropriate time to ask that question? I did, but now I'm second-guessing myself. I ain't holding up. I'm okay. Mm. 16 years old. It's just awful. It's all part of God's plan. I have the clothing drive flyers if you'd like to take a look. Thank you. <laughs> you all right, Mayor? No, not really. Um, I can't stop thinking about that little girl. I understand. That's why it's important in these times to take comfort in our faith. What if that's not doing the trick? Events like this can certainly create doubt. It happens to me more often than I'd like to admit. What do you do? I roll up my sleeves, and I work even harder at serving our Lord. Mary, we each have a relationship with God, and relationships take work. Get out there. Help the needy. Start a Bible study. Hug a stranger and tell them the Lord loves them. But not a child. That backfires on you. Big time. Thank you, Pastor Jeff. You are most welcome. Oh! And tell Sheldon I spoke to my seminary professor, and the official ruling is God would appear to the octopus aliens in octopus alien form and save their eight-legged souls. Praise Jesus! <laughs>